What's up YouTube? Welcome back to another video. Today we just have a casual unboxing video and I finally have my hands on the Beast X Mini and I'm very excited to test it out and try it. Let's get right into it. And if you don't know me, I am a Beast X lover. I love my Beast X. So I'm excited to see what the Mini has in store for me. I cannot get this thing off. Okay, let's go. I'll take these stickers off later. Okay, big reveal. Big reveal. Okay. I got the silver uh, mouse too, because I already have the black normal B stack, so wanted to try and get a different color. But um, yeah, let's, let's see it. Oh my god, whoa, that's so small. Wait, look at the size difference. Okay, first we got the dongle. It's a little cat. It sucks it doesn't have an interface though, because I'd like to see uh, what DPI and <clears throat> pulling hertz I'm on, but I like the design. It's very, very cute. And now we got the mouse itself. Now, first impressions. Does it feel any different from the regular Beast X? Oh, oh my god. It's definitely skinnier. I can tell you that. It definitely feels a lot skinnier. So my grip for the Beast X regular, I can't really show you, but it's like that. Versus the Beast X Mini it's like this so it's like this versus this i like it though i like that it's skinnier this one feels fat now this feels really fat compared to this what else do we have Ooh. okay we have these very nice looking glass skates i think yeah these ones are glass very cool very cool reminds me of print stream CSGO and then we have the cable it's just the same cable as the regular beast X um, and I imagine in here is the other skates oh yeah so we got the grips and oh these skates are actually different in the regular beast X there was no hole and I guess it's to show the logo. Oh, wait, is this to decorate your cat? Oh yeah, you can give it like different colored ears and stuff. And then they just gave us uh, three other random stickers. And then we got the user manual. And we also get a pouch for the mouse. This was not included with the last uh, the last beast x so very nice can i oh i can put my normal beast x in here too so it, like the size is universal that is very cool thank you wow w almas has like the best i guess fan service out of all the mouse companies that i've tested so far and i might put on the grip tapes just because this mouse is tiny i might need it um I'm gonna leave the PTFE skates, or the, sorry, the dot skates on. I guess I'll be right back with the mouse set up, and uh, yeah, I'll be right back. The cat's eyes glow. Okay, that is pretty cool. Oh, and it also has rubber feet on the bottom. That was not on the big two by two Rubik's Cube dongle. Okay, so that's cool. So now your dongle will stay in place. But um, yeah, so the first thing you want to do when you get this mouse is you obviously download the software. Okay, so this is different. This was not on the original Beast X. The main reason why I got this mouse in the first place is because of this feature right here, Angle Snap. I wanted to test that out. Um, that is not on the regular Beast X, so I just had to try it. Okay, so yeah, I think that's everything I 
need from the software uh, and let's test out the mouse in some games. So right away, one thing I'm noticing about the Beast X Mini is the scroll wheel is mushier Match than the found. original for some reason. The original feels, uh, it's like, it's like tactile and easy to scroll, but the, uh, the mini, it just, it's just not as tactile and it's kind of hard to scroll Death down. Match. Warm up. It's like there's something blocking the way. I don't know why. Okay, this monitor position is like really unfortunate for me because um, I have it far away because I need to put my webcam facing down onto my whole setup. So it's like really far away and I'm not used to this, but uh, so I don't really feel the angle snapping. I don't think it's that big of a deal. I don't know. Maybe I'm just not noticing the, the angle snapping. I do like the feel on, of the Beast X Mini a lot more than the regular Beast X though. The Beast X feels kind of fat now, like it feels wide. Okay, maybe you have to turn down your sense a bit more. Ten kills remaining. Three out of five. Okay, you can't really feel the scroll wheel that bad in game. Five but, kills remaining. well, why did they downgrade? Like, I don't understand. Headshot. Okay, I'm get. I'm definitely getting a lot more used to this mouse now. So I'm hitting. I'm hitting my shots. I'm starting to hit my shots. Goodbye. Oopsies. One kill remaining. One run. GG. Okay, I definitely yeah. like this mouse. I definitely like this mouse a lot more than this one. This one feels fat now. Oh my god. I I, I, I used to love this mouse so much, but now it just feels fat. Okay, so first impressions. The mini is beautiful. Um, I guess he only real problem with the mini is that the scroll wheel feels a lot more stiff hopefully it loosens up over time i don't know but uh yeah i definitely see it as an upgrade but uh that's just me but yeah um for fingertip grip and claw grip actually i think this mouse is the mouse to get but i'm not sure i'll have to keep testing this mouse out and um eventually i'll post an amateur reviews video on it uh but yeah first impressions very good very very good anyways i hope you guys enjoyed the video i'll see you guys later